This week, Lake Mead's water levels reached historic lows, putting the largest reservoir in the country fewer than 150 feet from dead pool, which occurs when the reservoir is so low that water cannot flow from the dam downstream. The water level of Lake Mead was 144.03 feet on Wednesday which is the lowest level it has been since the lake was filled in the 1930s. Lake Mead would hit Deadpool if the reservoir fell below 895 feet, which is still years away, and would have a significant impact on millions of people in Arizona, California, Nevada, and sections of Mexico. Robert Glennon, an emeritus professor at the University of Arizona who specializes in water law and policy, stated, this is extremely serious stuff. The depletion of Lake Mead has been caused by ongoing drought conditions over the past 20 years, which have been made worse by climate change and rising water demands in the southwest of the United States. Even though the reservoir is in danger of turning into a dead pool, Glennon predicted that it would probably take a few more years before it did. Even before Lake Mead reaches that stage, there are worries that water levels could drop so low that the generation of hydroelectric power would be hampered. A dead pool would not indicate that there was no water left in the reservoir.